really acceptable to walk up to a woman anymore. And if you're, if we're allowed to, like, do you have any tips on how to just approach somebody in the mm -hmm. real world rather than swiping left or swiping right? My tips for approaching somebody in the real world is different for a woman versus a man. So when it comes to women, I tell them walk up to them and pop the bubble by touching them. Because when it comes to men, it doesn't matter what you say, what matters is what you do. And when you, when you pop that invisible barrier that we have around us and you reach out and touch somebody, there's sort of a shocking element that happens in their brain and it sort of snaps them to attention. And then I say, say something funny, say something witty. Now this applies to both men and women. Always start with something that's gonna make the other person smile. And the reason is, you know those little muscles that we have around our eyes that crinkle up when we laugh? Those send a signal to the brain that tells you that you are having a pleasant experience. And your brain in response releases dopamine. Dopamine is your reward chemical. It's the same chemical your brain produces when you snort cocaine. Why do people do a line and then do another line? Reward. We like that reward sensation. So if you can make the other person smile right from the get-go, you are creating a sensation inside of them that makes them think, huh, I like this person, simply because they felt a rewarding emotion. So start with something funny and then have a small conversation. Say, you know, are you from around here? Maybe what do you do? And then end it quickly because you always want to leave before maybe they feel like you're taking too much of their time because you don't know how much of a rush they're in. And you always want, it, you always want people to finish on a high with you. So have a very short conversation and then say, I would love to grab a coffee with you. Let me give you my number and we'll get together. Now, women, give them your number and let them come after you if they're available, if they're interested. Men, ask for her number. I want you to be the hunter. I want you to tell her brain, I am so interested in you that I want to pull you into my life. So always make sure that you're creating a short, interesting, intriguing, rewarding conversation. And men, women are overwhelmed. They're overwhelmed online. They're overwhelmed in person because if they are attractive, chances are a lot of people are coming up and approaching them. So give before you take. For me, the most annoying thing is when a guy comes up to me and says, what's your name? That's a demand. Don't come up and immediately demand information. Put something at her feet that makes her smile. Give her a joke, give her a compliment. Start with that and she's gonna say, huh, this is somebody who's different. He's not coming at me and taking, he's coming to me and giving. And that always creates an upside to the conversation right from the get-go.